Hello, welcome back to the channel. Right before I start, I just want to say that if you would like to support the channel, you can do so through buymeacoffee.com. There, you can make donations to the channel and you can also suggest stories as well. I'll be putting a link in the description below. So again, if you want to donate to the channel, you can go to buymeacoffee.com. Once upon a time, in a small, sleepy town, a traveling carnival would arrive every year on the eve of Halloween. The townspeople eagerly awaited its arrival, and the carnival brought with it a sense of joy, excitement, and mystery. Little did they know that among the dazzling lights, creaking rides, and jovial laughter, there lurked a sinister presence that would change their lives forever. For years, whispers of a ghost haunting the carnival had spread throughout the town. It was said that the spirit belonged to a woman who had tragically lost her life in a freak accident on the carnival's ferris wheel many years ago. Some claim to have seen her wandering the grounds her long, tattered dress flowing in the wind, and her mournful wail echoing through the night. Late one Halloween Eve, a group of daring teenagers decided to test their courage by sneaking into the carnival after hours, hoping to catch a glimpse of the infamous ghost. Armed with flashlights, and a sense of adventure, they crept in through a gap in the carnival's fence, the silence of the night amplifying their every step. As the group ventured deeper into the carnival, they noticed a chill in the air and a sense of foreboding that grew more palpable with every passing moment. Then, without warning, the carnival lights flickered on baffling the ground in an eerie, utter, worldly glow. The ferris wheel began to creak and groan as it started to turn on its own, the rusty metal screeching ominously. The teenagers gasped as they saw a figure with dark, hollow eyes and a twisted smile, her tattered dress billowing in the wind standing on the platform of the ferris wheel. Suddenly, their flashlights flickered out, leaving them in complete darkness. The ghostly woman began to whisper, her voice filled with anguish and hatred. As she spoke, the carnival rides began to come to life, moving with unnatural speed and force. The teenagers, gripped by fear, started to run, their hearts pounding in their chest. The ghost pursued them, her whispers turning into blood-curling screams as the carnival became a nightmarish landscape of torment. One by one, the teenagers succumbed to the ghost's sinister grasp, her cold, lifeless hands dragging them into the shadows, never to be seen again. Only one teen managed to escape, forever haunted by the memories of that terrifying night. From that day on, the townspeople spoke in hushed voices about the carnival of whispers, and the sinister ghosts who claimed the souls of those foolish enough to wander its grounds after dark. Each year, the carnival returned to their town. They would bow their heads in silent prayer hoping to keep the vengeful spirit at bay. And so, the legend of the sinister ghost, forever bound to the carnival, continued to grow. A chilling reminder of the darkness that can lurk beneath the surface of even the most joyous of places. 